Hello, Lorenzo here. Welcome to the 15th episode of KSP to Mars, where we design rockets, unlock science, and attempt to get to Mars. Today, after yesterday's episode where we successfully orbited and eventually brought a Kermel Kerbal back safely, we are using the same rocket as a sort of ice, a science ICBM, a science missile. Instead of a capsule on the top of the rocket, we have a unmanned pod, unmanned uh, module with the science experiments, the goo canister and the materials bay, and we'll be attempting to land that in different biomes. Well, as is usual for the real solar system, the launches take a long time, so I'm going to show you a quick compilation of what happened. Enjoy that, and I will speak to you after that. And there we go, the second ICBM science missile touches down safely in the Highlands, I think, yeah, that's the Highlands, and gets the science, and so it goes on picking the different biomes and dropping a science pod there. It's a bit, it's a bit, it's a bit, well, how can I call it, weird, because we're sending a rocket there, doing the science, and then presumably sending a plane, a truck, a boat, or whatever, to recover it, then you might think that plane, boat, rocket, uh, well not the rocket, that plane, boat or helicopter might have brought along the science experiments in the first place, just not requiring a rocket with science payload to land there. Anyway, who am I to question these silly things? What I'm doing now is taking a look at the science archives and to determine which biomes I have and have not been. And you will see the water, so the actual watery bits of Kerbin, have not been adequately explored. And if you might recall, if you may recall, uh, next to the KSC is a ample axis of abundant water, otherwise known as the ocean. So I got the luminous idea to make a quick rocket that would splash down some science payload in the water. It didn't go well. It didn't go well immediately, and um, it didn't immediately go well, and it immediately didn't go well. well n don't know what I'm saying, but enjoy, let's call it a blooper reel of water exploring rockets. Here you go. And with that oceanic 
exploration spectacle completed. We have that data in the pocket at least and we're going to send one more big space missile to explore another biome. It looks much the same as all the others did, apart from the re-entry which was fairly exciting. And in fact, save failed to save anything of the craft. There you go, it explodes, lacking the heat shield and dies. Fortunately though, we had enough science. So here I proceed to the research and development building and you will see that we had 112 science points at this point, enough to unlock a node. And old me here immediately beelines it for the engine parts. It seems big and therefore it must be good. That's what I was thinking at any rate. Look at the next episode to see how happy I was with that choice. While I'm here reviewing every bit, I'm going to choose the engine. I know that because it was me in the past that did that. This was today's episode anyway. See how I get on with the bigger engine tomorrow with the next episode. This was Lorenzo. Thank you for watching. If you did enjoy it, show that please by hitting the like, subscribe or the comment field. So I always like to see activity there. Anyway, thanks again for watching. This was Lorenzo. Goodbye.